One tool you can use at home is a wooden dowel or a broomstick to work on your hip mobility. Um, this might feel a little silly, but all you're gonna do is you're gonna grab your hands together at the middle of the broom here, and you're just gonna move your hands forward and back like this. So if you see it from the front, the top view here, my hands are doing this. Now, how we're gonna add our hips into it is my feet are gonna be shoulder width apart. Instead of having my hands doing the motion here, my hips are gonna move my hands. So, so my hands are just there to hold on to the broomstick, but my hips are moving my shoulders and now it's moving the broomstick by default, right? So I'm going here. If I keep my hips stable, I'm just moving it with my shoulders like this and my hands are going back and forth. But as I move my hips into it, it's actually gonna use my arms kind of as an engine here to really, to really uh, move the broomstick back and forth. So here, imagine every single time you throw a punch out, your hips are kind of shaking or vibrating to add a little more power to that, right? So here. So this motion of throwing my one, two punch, right? Right, my left and my right. You can see how the hip kind of gets incorporated into there. That same motion happens when you do this. And then as you drill that more, you're gonna be able to incorporate different angles. So I'm going from horizontal to 45, to the other 45, and all the way vertical. Generally speaking, you wanna have your fists touching, but you can have your hands a like shoulder width apart here and do the same motion. It might feel a little more comfortable that way to uh, kind of mimic more of the punching, more uh, punches, right? So my hands are here. They're not really punching from close here, but they might be punching from out here. The same width as we uh, hold the broomstick. So I'm going like this. Thank you.